we've got the display unit to, right here, the unit that's going to be shipped to you. We're going to go ahead and load up a wafer. So we go ahead and put your boat down right there, and then we're going to start a recipe by selecting Execute. First thing you'll notice is the wafer being pulled out right here into the flap finder that's been modified for the wafer size. Does the flat finder and then is loaded into the exchange chamber. The exchange chamber is going to start pumping down and in a few moments it'll drop it into the uh, main exchange chamber. See we've got a very good vacuum up there on our iron pumps. the wafer being put on the holder. Being pushed into the main chamber and now is going to do the inspection do the CD measurements here. It goes to the first alignment site. And the second alignment site. Go up to the first uh, site for measurement. Fix the center line. Does a quick autofocus. Very nice resolution there. And takes the measurement. Moves on to site number two. Uses a pattern rack, select the feature, does a quick autofocus, integrates, and another measurement done. We can see up here the score is on the pattern recognition in the 900 range. Uh, image is looking very good. During our testing, we do save the images on each site to review. We're using the Pierce algorithm for the feature because it's uh, the best one for that. And coming up to the last measurement site. Before it pulls the wafer out, it'll display the worksheet. Uh, we've selected to do that for some of our testing. Which we can review the measurements and the images here. And if we're satisfied, we go ahead and say OK, and the wafer will be uh, removed from the chamber and put back into the cassette. for the exchange chamber. It's vented, it's going to reach in, grab the wafer and safely put it back into the set.